Hey, welcome to the Three County Fair. Johnny Memphis here with my band, the Johnny Memphis Band. We're playing at the Three County Fair. It's such a treat to be here and doing this. It's my hometown. It's, I'm from Pennsylvania originally, but I've lived here so long. Northampton is, is where I'm from now, you know. I have been for a long time. And here we are at the beautiful Three County Fair. It's a scene, it's Labor Day weekend. And uh, my band, the quintet, is uh, playing on stage here. Some of the lifetime. For you and I, it's a wonderful memory. But there's one thing I right. I was some other boyfriend, some other guy, some other boyfriend. Fun to just play here at the Three County Fair, you know. I used to live right over the way on Pomeroy Terrace, right on the edge of the fairgrounds, and um, people would park there and uh, walk across the fields to the fairgrounds. And this place has just always been a part of my life. Still the same guy that you always knew. Pocket full of pretzels and my eyes are blue. It's to be expected that I get confused when all I ever do is dream of you. All I ever do is dream of you. All I ever do is dream. One of the fun ones for me to play tonight was Dating Myself, which is a song I wrote a long time ago, but I've revived it, and one reason I wanted to play it, because in that song, I mentioned Kitty Wells at the County Fair. It's basically a song where I'm talking about all the shows I've seen, and I call it Dating Myself, because then I basically say, but I've, I've never met you, and so I'm, I'm dating myself in two ways. But um, Kitty Wells was here and saw her the very first female country western star, and um, that song is just fun. It goes, it just spirals into like things I could never have possibly seen, like Cleopatra. I saw Cleopatra sail the river night. I saw Charlie Chaplin on the set of Gomer Pie. I got high with Janice, stone with Cheech and Chong. Piled around with Elvis, some guy who knew King Kong. Thank you so much. Catherine first on the fiddle. There she is. Jason Smith on drums. Paul Hartshorn on guitar. Woo! Lori Rosenfeld on banjo. Yeah. My name's Johnny Memphis when I'm on stage. So the first band I was in, the Suburban Head Swappers, um, they said, hey, you want to play bass in this band? And I said, I don't know how to play bass. They said, that's OK. You don't have to know how. It was that kind of band. It was just kind of a punk do-it-yourself crazy band. A lot of fun. They gave me this cheap Memphis bass guitar to play, and I, they said, hey, you should be Johnny Memphis. So I just took that name. And then I got a job on the radio, and they, I told, I asked them, hey, do you mind if I use the name Johnny Memphis? Sort of sounded cool. So I did that, and then I just kept using that forever and ever. I've used it to write books and do a lot of radio, and now I got the Johnny Memphis band. And finally, I wrote a song called Never Been to Memphis. I've never been to Memphis. I've never had that barbecue. Never been to Graceland. Never seen the jungle room. But I got Memphis on my jukebox. Green onions, my ringtone. No, I've never been to Memphis. Someday I'm The funky chicken. They say they do it everywhere. I'm gonna take you to the river. Oh, you know I'll take you there. Oh, I wonder what it looks like. I really do not know. No, I never been to Memphis. Someday I'll. Yeah, I got a great band, so happy to be playing with these people. Paul Hartzorn, the guitar player, he and I have been in a lot of bands over the years. 
just incredible. I started out in the suburban head swappers. Then we were in Pie Fight and Check Please, the disco garage band. And Paul and I just jammed forever, so he was always going to kind of be in it. And I wanted a fiddler. I was making some recordings and I knew Catherine first. She's a great fiddler. So I got her to be on the album. And I was like, Catherine, why don't you be in the band? Catherine. So she got in the band. And then Jason, the drummer, uh, Jason Smith, I, I taught with him at Frontier high school we were both teaching social studies in middle school he's a great drummer it's like uh, hey Jason why don't you play this record and then I lured him into the band <laughs> now he's in the band and the, the most recent members Lori Rosenfeld who is a great singer banjo player and she again I was doing a recording I needed banjo this is how it happens. And then it's sort of like, hey, why don't you just stay in the band? So now we got her in. Another thing I want to mention is just getting Laurie singing. Laurie's such a good singer. So I love hearing her and Paul singing that country duet, If I Could Only Win Your Love. Beautiful harmonies on that. And uh, Paul's a great harmony singer. And singing with Laurie, that's a new thing in the band that we're developing more and more. Also, hearing Laurie singing um, Love Light, we go into that Turn On Your Love Light, that great old song. Uh, Bobby Blue Bland that the Grateful Dead also did and a million other people and uh, Laurie just kills that. So the first time I ever came to Northampton was to the Three County Fairgrounds, right where we are. I was right over there, actually, because they had a giant stage set up for a huge concert that got too many people, and they knocked down the fences. The fans knocked down the fences and burned the wooden fences. And then it was just a wild scene here. My neighbor, Dennis, was there. He brought in a case of beer with a friend of his. Said there was, like, no security, just wide open. And it was incredible. Like, I just had that, I remember that feeling like, where am I? What is this? I remember it was near 91 where the fairgrounds were. And then I ended up three years later moving here because I had some family move here. And then I got involved in the music scene. I started writing for the newspaper, got on the radio, then got in bands, and then got my own band, and uh, came back to play here at the very same place that I was the very first time. There's just something beautiful about that, coming back to the place where it all started for me in our band. Yeah, and our music, you know, our music is really a lot of things, but one of the things it's definitely about is fun. And uh, I'm not afraid of fun. I like fun. I believe in fun. I think there has been enough fun. And there's a lot of hard times in the world and in your good life, evening. so it's good to have fun. And uh, our music reflects that, and it's, there's a lot of upbeat things and a danceable stuff. We try to give a little bit of a dance beat wherever we can because you want to bring something that people can at least tap their toes to, if not get up and boogie. I laid around and played around 
this old town too long. Summer's almost gone, yeah, winter's coming on. Played around, played around, this old town's